When you've got the best lacrosse team in the country in your state, it's tough for others to get attention. But the DU women deserve it. The Pioneer ladies, like the men, are undefeated and ranked number 14 in the country. I think they kind of give us the motivation to work harder and be just like them, and we just don't want to hear Denver men's lacrosse. We want to hear Denver and women's men lacrosse for uh, DU. DU is good, and yet they are not the best team in our state. According to the rankings, CU is. The Buffs are number nine in just their fourth year as a varsity program. You know, four years ago with our first season building the program and now to have a full class of seniors, just to see the growth in them and the growth in the team, um, I think year to year has really been exciting. And I think we're in an exciting position right now and we just have to stay focused as we continue. Both the Buffs and Pioneers can claim they're the best team in our state, but there's no need to talk. We'll find out on the field on Friday. This is a big game on Friday. Denver is also undefeated. They're 5-0 and right now and also doing incredibly well this season and ranked. So I mean, to have two ranked teams, I think, in Colorado is something incredibly special. Absolutely is awesome. I think it's um, it's just so fantastic for the state and just West, Western lacrosse period to see two teams in the top 20 at the same time. Um, you know, I'm excited for CU and I'm excited for us. I, I hope at the end of the season we're, we're both able to kind of continue it um, and, and be in the, the tournament together. In Boulder and Denver. Rod Mackey, 9 News.